how is the ark been proven? What do you mean how? how I mean, how, how, the, the story okay, of knowing the ark, okay, how is that been proven? Let me put it like this. Um, there have been situations in the Bible. You remember the founding of um, Babylon, of Babel, Babel itself. Yeah. They found uh, Babel. I'll give you a prime, give you a better example. People, some people will say that um, Moses never lived. Okay. Because they could never find his body. God buried his body. To this day, we don't know. Yeah, but you're, it's, it's going to, coming right back to the same thing. Is that when you look at evidence? Um, I lived in Atlanta uh, 25 years. Have you been? Uh, have you heard of Stone Mountain? No. Stone Mountain is right in right outside of Atlanta. Atlanta really is on the Stone Mountain is the top of a mountain. The mountain is 100 miles in circumference. On top of the mountain, they found seashells, they found shrimp, and crested into the mountain. Mm -hmm. um, where did it come from? I mean, that, that, that's true. That, that, that's, that I didn't say that everything in the Bible, of course, I mean, it's taken accounts. I didn't say everything so in the Bible. So that must have been, it was but a you flood. Said, that you must said, have been a flood. You, you, but what you said is named something. Mm -hmm. And what, what I'm saying is knowing the art. We don't. You, you don't have any evidence for that. You said name something that you don't yeah. have any okay, evidence well, for. Okay, well, let me just like any. wood and everything else. Would that not have decayed over the period of time? I, uh, I don't know because I haven't seen it. So oh, I'm just yeah, I mean, it, it could unless it was in stone. Um, yeah. it, it could have been frozen in a mountain. Could have been. Maybe not. But there, there's that. That's something that we we have evidence to the contrary. The, the contrary, though, because we if we had all the technology today, we could not get all the animals on the yard. And then you have to account for viruses, um, you know, bacteria, HIV. Um, but we're, talk we're talking about the, the creator, the one that has the power <laughs> to control so everything. He, this was his divine mm -hmm. decree that he was going to wipe disobedient, wicked acting mankind off the face of the earth. Mm -hmm. So, but I mean, it's, so he, he just used like powers to use to make, what? He just used like magic to make everything. It's, it's his Holy Spirit. Yeah. He don't, magic is demon, demon, demonic. Yeah. So no, yeah. no magic. His Holy Spirit that he uses to accomplish his will. You think like he divided the animals? I mean, so he, 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 he made sure, he, he knew his purpose. Because he's a God of purpose. Mm -hmm. He knew that once this um, devastation of disobedient mankind was over. He was going to have Noah and his family to repopulate this earth. And that's what we believe. That that's why we're here today. We originated from Noah and his family. How, how do you explain, like, the DNA variation? How do you explain that? I, I don't. I'm not. Because it's, it's, it's my faith. I'm going to go by my faith that this is what Almighty God has said. But that this means you're, 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 you're pretty much saying that you're going to turn a blind eye to the evidence. But, I mean, but the point is, I mean, when you look at this picture, you have people, all these people are descendants of Noah and his family, okay? All humans, normal humans, are the same. You take the skin off, your heart is the same place no, as they're, mine, they're, 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 right? they're not the same because we have fossil evidence of humans in, in, a, in a more aggressive state. Okay. That's that's what I'm talking about, the fossil evidence. We weren't the same. Our bodies were shaped differently, our DNA was different. Human humans in the beginning of humans, in the very, very beginning, Six. are not the same that they are now. Before Adam and Eve? Before well, creation of them from well, the I, I, the world? we have I mean we have evidence of millions and millions of years ago that we had humans. We have that evidence. Well, I tell you, I mean, I, I can't argue with you because I haven't seen the fossils. So, I mean, you know, the only thing I can go by. I mean, well, maybe next time I could, I could, I could show you the sure, fossils. Sure, sure. And, and the point is, it's like I said, now, we do know prior to Adam and Eve, there were dinosaurs and all these things. We know this. Uh, according to all of our references, the first humans created 
was Adam and Eve. I mean, if if, if it was some people else, we don't know about it. I mean, it, I don't it, know about it. I'd put it like it, It's cool that you it. mentioned that because one, one hypothesis I, I was uh, throwing at him, uh, I, don't, uh -huh. I, I forgot what you had thought about it, was maybe, you know, maybe if the Bible is true that, you know, we are you you you, you do accept that, that evolution within kinds can happen, right? What do you mean? Uh, evolution within kinds, like uh, the very that's how you would account from from the, all the animals on the, the earth today. I'm at, at the ark, uh, splitting into the, the variety that we have today. So you admit that happened. So maybe you know when when God created Adam or or gave the rib to, to Eve. Maybe it was the animal had evolved to that point, and then he gave it the spirit of, of humans, and and, and uh, that's when you know it. No, it was, uh, no, you know, no, 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 no. I, I, no, I, I, mean, I, I was theorizing. What, what I will, <laughs> what, what I will you believe in dinosaurs? Like you believe dinosaurs lived on Earth? Sure. At what point in time? Before Adam and Eve. Of course, way before that. So, but Being you, would demand, you would say that the, the Earth is older than. Point in which we, be, we believe that the Earth is over four billion years old. Okay. Okay. But, but that, doesn't that go contrary to what the Bible says? No. Mm -hmm. No. No. But doesn't the Bible say like six thousand years? The Bible man, day. we're talking about man. Okay. We got six thousand years. Well, where does it say the age? I mean, but when you read Genesis, um, Genesis will tell you that. Um, God created the animals, right? Then, before man. Huh? Before, man. man. before man. Okay. Now, then he created man. See, the Bible will go, it's, to give you a prime example, the Bible does not tell you everything about Jesus. Like when he was 17, what did he do? Did he yeah. Know? Because it really wasn't important to the facts. The same things with other characters in the Bible. It told you the Bible tells you all of the pertinent information. You know. Now, with that, we the Bible tells us about the creation. What was created first, and then it came down. And, to and, and it, it actually does kind of go in harmony with um, the way scientists say the Earth formed. Um, you know, at one time it, it would have been a really hot place with the, with mm -hmm. the liquid with liquid, uh, you know, Earth. Uh, so actually, it does go in harmony mm -hmm. with, with the way Genesis describes yeah, it. Yeah, it does. And so the point is, is that we know that fossil records tell you, and sure, you go to the museum, you see dinosaurs and uh, Tyrannosaurus and all these yeah. different things. So we know uh, that they exist. How they look, how did they, uh, we don't know because... How did they die? Huh? How did they become extinct? I don't know. The Bible don't tell us how what happened to them, and it could have been you know the an explosion. It could have been a uh, meteor hitting well, the or earth. What if, or no, what if they didn't? God didn't allow them to pass pass the flood. They, they wasn't living. The dinosaurs oh, okay. wasn't living then. Okay. Yeah, because it, it uh, man was. So man, you believe man never existed with dinosaurs? No, no, okay. no, no. Because <laughs> a lot of yeah. a lot of creationists do. The, mm -hmm. A lot of like young Earth creationists, mm -hmm. um, like uh, Eric Hovind, Kent Hovind, mm -hmm. you're familiar with them. We believe that the first humans that lived on the earth was Adam and Eve. Now, I can't tell you, I don't think we tell you what the Bible said. Other than that, I'll be in trouble. Um, it is proven from us that, of course, like I said, dinosaurs are there and all the sea creatures and stuff like that. Uh, we got evidence of that. Then when man came, then uh, the animals at that time was not the dinosaurs. Basically, animals at that time was domesticated. domesticated. They were domesticated, and they were quote unquote friendly to man, to Adam and Eve, and to everybody else. Um, everything was vegetarian. Huh? Everything yeah, was vegetarian. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah. What, how how could you explain? Well, I guess for people that's supposed to. Yeah, oh, because it's about good. Are we doing next time? <laughs> yeah. I, you know, I, I think we'll be back.